The admissions investigation launched at UCLA five years ago involved coaches of the water polo, tennis, and track and field teams. Also questioned, Rick Singer, the admitted mastermind of the college cheating scandal, still unfolding today. After a water polo recruit was rejected from UCLA, her mother appealed the university's decision. According to the confidential investigation, first reported by the LA Times, even though her daughter didn't play water polo, the mother stated she was still willing to pay and that she understood from Singer that she was expected to donate $100,000 to the program for the admission of her daughter through athletics. It's a striking similarity in the pay-to-play scheme that led to 51 arrests this year. UCLA saying it's implemented a new policy, adding there were no allegations of Singer's criminal activity at that time. Payment in some form or another and a wink and a nod to get into college has always been part of the super competitive world of college admissions. With universities under scrutiny for what they knew, tomorrow Felicity Huffman becomes the first parent to be sentenced after pleading guilty to fraud. The stage now set for this actress to face justice. And Miguel joins us right now. This week, the probation department weighed in on the charges that Felicity Huffman is facing. What did they say? Well, the probation department said there was no actual or intended loss from Huffman's crime, so this could set the stage for no prison time. That's in stark contrast to what prosecutors are asking for one month behind bars. Ultimately, it's up to a judge. We'll find out what she decides tomorrow. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.